Zhang Ailing's The Story of the Golden Lock. From a psychological perspective, why Kikiao is psychologically distorted. Kikiao is sleeping on the cigarette shop. She has been wearing a golden shackle for 30 years. She used the heavy shackle horns to kill several people. And those who survived lost half their lives. This sentence comes from the story of the golden lock. This sentence describes a woman named Kao Kikiao. Zhang Ailing's works always have the shadow of Dream of Red Mansions, perhaps due to her similar life experience to Kao Zukin, or perhaps due to her grief and anger with nowhere to express. In that war-torn era, only her works could express the situation of women. The unreserved portrayal of the dark side deep in their hearts fully displays human desires and survival dilemmas before their eyes. She once said, there are always a lot of things wrong with women, but there is a little bit of the roots of Mother Earth in a woman's spirit. In her writing, there is no absolute good or evil, only the ugliness of human nature. This is what the story of the Golden Lock is like. A novel. The story of the story of the Golden Lock is as follows. Kao Kikiao, the daughter of an ordinary merchant who opened a sesame oil shop was introduced by a matchmaker to marry the second young master of a wealthy and ginger-like noble family. She was full of joy but did not know that the second young master was Ricketts. The patient, her husband-in-law, and her family deceived her until her wedding night. Because of Kikiao's background, she was ostracized by others in the Zhang family and could not get emotional comfort. Gradually, Kikiao turned into a mean and poisonous woman. Because of her selfishness, she ruined the lives of her two children. Why is Kikiao psychologically distorted? When many people read this novel, the further they read, the more disgusting they find her. If you think about it carefully, she was born in a family that was not wealthy, but had a comfortable life. She was originally an ordinary girl who longed for life and love. She originally had someone who fell in love with her. However, after she married into the Zhang family, she saw that with her bedridden husband, her sisters-in-law and mother-in-law paid little attention to her, and even the maids looked down upon her. Unable to bear the loneliness, she used money as a life-saving straw and meanness as a weapon, cutting off her own escape route. Ruined his life. First, from the perspective of social psychology, Kikiao has gradually become what it is pretending to be. Kikiao held the mirror with both hands, the green bamboo curtain and a pair of golden and green landscape screens reflected in the mirror were still rippling back and forth in the wind. After looking at it for a long time, I felt seasick. When I looked at it again, the green bamboo curtain and the green landscape screen were still swaying in the wind. The bamboo curtain has faded, the golden and green landscape has been replaced by a portrait of her husband, and the person in the mirror has aged 10 years. If it weren't for the fact that the second young master couldn't marry into a noble family due to his health, Kikiao wouldn't have been able to get into the Zhang family just because of his background. Kikiao herself also knew that people in the Zhang family looked down upon her. So whenever there was a new rival in the Zhang family, she was always extra. Affectionate to people, but people would make their own decisions. As time went by, no one paid much attention to her and Kikiao also found her boring. From then on, she became the one who gossiped about others in the family. Ignoring her, she often went to the old lady to gossip, and she became even more unpopular from then on. In psychology, there is a word situational attribution. Simply put, it refers to the external factors that influence the occurrence of behavior, including opportunities, other people, the environment, etc. Circumstances can change a person's personality, and situations can instantly change a person's behavior. Speaking of this, we have to mention the famous Stanford experiment. In 1971, psychology professor Philip Zimbardo and his colleagues built a simulated prison in the basement of the university. He recruited 20 for mentally healthy volunteers, came to participate in a two-week prison experiment. Among these people, nine people acted as police officers, nine people acted as prisoners, and the other six people were substitutes. The experiment truly simulated the situation in the prison. The prisoners were searched, wore prison uniforms, and wore shackles. Not long after the experiment began, the people playing the role of prison guards began to become violent. 
while the people playing the role of prisoners were planning to rebel. This research experiment on human behavior was terminated after less than a week, which also caused widespread controversy. As a person grows up, he is always affected by the surrounding environment. There is an old Chinese saying, those who are close to red are red, and those who are close to ink are black. If you are in a certain environment, you will become a certain type of person. The changes in human nature are also huge. This is something that the people in the Stanford experiment could not even imagine. They could not even explain their own behavior. Kikiao also slowly changed in the environment. Perhaps she was swallowed up by reality without even realizing it. She became a bird painted on the screen in the courtyard of a deep house. She had no value, no freedom, and struggled hopelessly. She tried to find herself and slowly became aggressive. In order to attract attention, over time, she became a disguise. What is real? What is fake? Can't tell. Second, from the perspective of individual psychology, Kikiao slowly distorted. Him Sulfikia likes GZ, the third child of the Zhang family. She has tested GZ many times, both secretly and overtly. GZ is used to hanging out in flower streets and willow alleys because he is afraid of getting into trouble. He never expresses it. Kikiao cannot get any comfort from her husband, placed her hopes on GZ, but was repeatedly rejected and eventually developed a morbid mentality and she began to hate the happiness of others. On her wedding day, her son's words were full of abuse and ridicule. Her daughter's happy smile and love, in her opinion, was a sarcasm and a mockery of her. Freudian psychology focuses on three parts, ID, ego and superego. The ego is a basic human need, which can also be said to be a desire and impulse. The self is the highest level of psychological activity, a kind of self-awareness, and the desire to control impulses. The superego is between the two and plays a role in balancing and regulating. When the desires of the ID are overly suppressed, the balance will be destroyed, resulting in a morbid psychology. Kikiao's distorted psychology was slowly formed through long-term depression. In fact, Kikiao also confided in her family that her brother and sister-in-law would occasionally visit her. After all, she always hoped to get some help from her family. Whenever they left, Kikiao never left them with anything. However, she only had biased demands from her brother and sister-in-law, who even encouraged her to smoke opium. Kikiao could not be released for a long time, so he resorted to hurting others to comfort himself. However, he fell deeper and deeper into the trap without being released, which also dragged down his two children. In the end, both his son and daughter spent the rest of their lives addicted to the cigarette shop. In the study of individual psychology, there is a mentality of not wanting others to be better than oneself. Researchers in the psychoanalytic community define this as envy. This kind of paranoia is very suitable for Kikiao. The explanation is that Kikiao can't see hope and feels that she can't have good things. She has tried various methods but still can't change the status quo. She can't rob other people's happiness, so she will destroy all those who have happiness, which at least proves that she has a sense of existence. She feels that only in this way will she not be laughed at. Rather than saying that Kikiao is cruel to others, it is more cruel to say that she distorts herself. She uses the most clumsy way to say no to the world. Third, conclusion in the human heart. We both seek life and death. We pursue both light and darkness. We long for love, but sometimes we waste the love in our hands almost self-destructively. There seems to be a desolate night in the human heart. The earth is left to the dark and lonely self. Fruit book says that the moon of 30 years has already set, and the story of 30 years is not over yet. Looking back at Kikiao's life, the cruelty of reality and the indifference of her relatives, made her feel that money was the only thing that could be grasped. She told her daughter that men are unreliable and are all here for money, but she herself she had only experienced a man like her husband. She returned all the indifference she had felt, but she returned it in the wrong place and to the wrong person. After reading the story of the golden lock, I lamented the helplessness of fate. The deeper the pain, the closer the person is to the abyss. Think about it. Fortunately, 
We were not born in that era that was unfair to women. Fortunately, we grew up in a positive environment. Fortunately, we have family and friends, so we don't need to be depressed. All right, this story has come to an end. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you.